Yeah, we'll carry on. Learning your times tables as a child could never be classed as fun, but a pioneer thinks he's come up with a way to make it a little more entertaining. Yes, Clifford Harding is planning to release a CD called Tunes Times Tables to help schools teach multiplication using rap. We okay. sent James <laughs> right along for a bit of math revision. One time eight is eight, so that means they'll be late. One time eight is eight, so that means they'll be late. It looks more like a drama class, but at Greek Primary School in Spark Hill in Birmingham, this is a maths lesson with a difference. As a dyslexic, Clifford Harding found it very difficult to learn multiplication when he was growing up. But when he began work as a learning mentor, he found himself having to teach others how to do their times tables. One day I was like in the class and we were doing maths with a child, and I was like, I don't even know the answer myself. So I decided to sit, sit down and actually put something together in a rap kind of way, but I don't call it rap. I think the children react to it very well because um, it's got rhyming, it's got positive lyrics in there, and it's got dancing, and it's energetic, and it's not the everyday pen to paper. Now I remember learning my times tables as a kid and being reduced almost to tears, but this class of six and seven year olds seems to be taking it in their stride. Teachers agree it's having a positive effect on the children's learning experience. I think because it incorporates the, the movement and the music, it makes it more accessible for all children of all abilities to, to use and to learn. In the past, we concentrated on the two, five and ten times table, and it's been difficult to move the very young children to learn the more complicated numbers. Who used to like doing their times tables before rap? One, two, not many people. Who, now that they're doing it to rap, likes their times tables? Big show of hands. Why do you, why do you like it? Because I, I like the rhymes. Do you reckon it's time for a bit of a test? Yeah. Six times eight? This what you I was a member of the I think that's a good one. Two times eight? Sixty. Always keep your bedroom clean. Five times eight. Clifford plans to roll out his musical math scheme next year so that more school children can remember their tables more easily. James Wright in Spark Hill for Central Tonight. It's Central Tonight and it's quarter past six. And indeed it is. Good. And uh, let's take a look at what's to come in the National and International <laughs> ITV News.